What we have here is my favorite sleigh design for dragging around. You can see mine's over there on that side. I've been dragging around for a year. A few changes here and there to make it work best. Really comfortable with how it works, so I'm making three of these now. Figured I'd share some stuff. So it's uh, 16 inches wide, 12 feet long, takes five cans of gas laid down, oil jug up in the front and room for a small bag too. I've been trying to do these uh, simpler, less welding and stuff so people can uh, duplicate them easier. So uh, see the 10 foot runner only comes to here so that's two pieces of three doubled up because it gives you a nicer transition for backing up or for backing up. So that works with the two bolts there. I haven't had any issues with that on the other ones. I'm comfortable with that design there. This is new. That's a friend's idea. I like it a lot rather than uh, you see all these welded ones. They're a lot of work. They're slow. The paint rubs off. They rust. This is just a uh, barrel bolt or coupling bolts, U-bolt, then the flathead countersink ones up through the bottom. That's good. Uh, the bars here, that's because there's carbides there, and if you don't put bars there, the carbides don't bite. So, still a little bit of welding. Nothing serious, so you can see that these are all drilled out, so you can get your socket down your carbide and change it out. And you'll also see there's no welding up and down on the bar to make a weak point where it's going to want to break. So, welding here, welding here, but none up and down. Uh, inch and a half tubing inch and a half tubing, all except the very front one. That's more of these tie downs. You can see these uh, generic tie downs you can buy cheap. So uh, another couple of things is this bolt. You see here, doesn't go through the sheet. This bolt goes through the sheet. So when it's pushing down here, you don't have a spot for it to break. And uh, which one? This one here, right ahead of the stiffener. That one also doesn't go through the sheet, just flat on the bottom. Or as you see, like normally they go through the uh, runner. Sorry, this one does go through the sheet. It only goes through the sheet, not through the runner. So they normally go through the runner, but right here ahead of that, not through the runner. Uh, Joey did these bars for me. Makes more room in the front rather than the uh, Rather than like the A design in the front, these here bent ones just does really nice. Simple strap here for hooking on. I showed you this before, that's for the pintle. Everything safety wired on so you can't lose it. Anyway, hope that helps someone. That is the easiest, fastest, safest way to tow five cans in my opinion. Tracks really, really, really straight. Doesn't hop around on you super easy for breaking trail because it's so narrow anyway i like it that there that's another story that was a big whoops yesterday so anyway i guess stay tuned for an update on that